Hi guys, welcome back. Daisy uh, Dawn Gamer here, and I'm going to be showing you how to install um, mods for modifying Java Edition. So the first thing you're going to need is extra Java. So when you get it, it'll bring up this uh, this page, and um, I'll put the link to this in the description. And you're going to click Agree and start free download. It will take quite a bit of time to download. So you're going to wait until this is done. Could take a minute. I'm going to click open when done because I'm impatient. And then you're going to want to go to Forge. Okay, so it is going to have to ask you after you open the Java for your PIN or password so that you can, it can make changes to your device. You're going to want to put this in. That's not correct, is it? Okay, there we go. There we go, that should work. Okay, and then you're going to want to go to your Forge. While well, that's downloading. Okay, and then you're just going to click this. I'll leave the link again in the description. 16.5. And then you're going to want download latest, and it'll install it for you. After you click that, there is going to be one thing you're going to have to do, though. Do not click anything down here, or don't click create forge server. There will be a count down here, and then you can click skip. Do not click anything that pops up here. It'll download forge for you automatically. And you will be having um, extra Java. Um, download stuff so you're gonna have to do some stuff for that I already did it so you'll just have some pop-ups there do not click anything down here and after you've clicked it don't click anything up here either you're gonna click open when done or just click open if you're not impatient and you're plenty patient so you might want to just check out the mod if you want to learn more about this mod uh, make sure and check out my videos on it yeah they're pretty interesting Okay, so, here's this. Okay, so here's the Java setup. You're just going to click install, and it's going to start installing it. If yours pops up, mine didn't really. So you're, you might have to go looking for it. This could take a minute. Okay, so, well, you're not doing that. You can watch for your Forge thing. Mine's disappeared, which means it, it's opening up. It'll be open in a minute. Ah, there we go. Mod System Installer. And then you're going to click Install Client if it isn't already clicked. And you're going to go, okay. And it is going to download it for you. You might want to check on your job while this is happening. Mine's almost done here. And this is another good time to look at your mod. Mini horses. <laughs> okay, so then your Java or your Forge notification will pop up, and you're just going to click OK, and then it'll be done. And then you are going to have to reload Minecraft here. So you're going to click the X, and then you are going to just bring it back up. And it should be downloaded. If it's not, there's an Quick and easy fix for this. I'll show you it to you after my Minecraft loads. Because I don't really trust it to. Okay, and then... Not now. But you're going to click Install. Next. And then, yeah, it's installed. Another pop-up might happen. Yes. Close. Okay. And then, come on, load. Okay, so then if you go to Installations, it should be there. If it's not, here's what to do. Click New Installation and then look for it. It should 
have something here. Release 1.16 Forge. You're just going to click it, click Create, and then you might want to name it. Okay, so that's pretty much how you do it. And then you are going to have to download your mod. So then it goes out of all of these. I'm not going to because I have to get the links. So then you're going to go to Files. You're going to choose the one you want, which is the latest, 1.16.5. And then you're going to click download. And it'll bring up this download counter here. Okay. Perfect. It's downloading now, and it'll bring up that. And then you're going to click keep. Otherwise, you won't be able to get your mod. This one you're not going to open. So just wait for it to download. Perfect. And then you're going to bring up your Minecraft mods folder. So you're going to go into this, click your files, your forge, and then it'll bring up this roaming Minecraft thing. So then you're just going to click mods. If you don't have one, you can just create a new folder like this. Click new folder and then mods. I'm not actually going to make it, so I'm going to delete mine. Okay, so then you can go into your mods folder, and then you can make it a little small, and then you can click realistic horse things, and then I'm going to bring mine up here, because I'll show you how this works. Okay, so mods, minimize, that'll bring this up. So then you can just drag this, and then you can drag it in to your mods folder. And see, it's here. Or you can go to the home screen and drag it there and then drag it in here. That's probably the better way to do it. But since I can't do that without exiting out of the video, then I'm just gonna do this. Okay? And you can close up your mod mods folder. You can go back to your Minecraft launcher and then you can click through installations, hover over forge and just click play. And yes, I'll start naming. It will ask you if you, it will warn you about modified Java edition. And you're just gonna click, I understand the risks. And if you want to, don't show me this again. Okay. Waiting for it to install. This could take a minute. Okay, so it'll just load yours, and if you have any questions or comments on this, feel free to give me a comment, and I'll make sure to check it out. Um, okay, bye! See you all next time. Daisy Dawn Gamer, signing out.